welcome back to my channel and if you're new to my channel welcome to my channel so today we're going to be doing a total ab workout and the way the workout is structured you're going to be working for 40 seconds and then you're going to get a 10 second break we're first going to be doing some standing ab workouts and then we're going to move into the plank variation of ab workouts and then the crunch variation of ab workouts so let's get right into it We are going to begin this ab series with high knees. Raise your knee until your thigh is leveled with the floor. Stand tall and keep your back straight, alternating your legs. Alternating oblique crunch neck. Start standing with your feet at shoulder width. Raise your arms above your head, then turn slightly to your right as you lift your right knee up towards your left shoulder. Place your right foot back down. We will perform two crunches here and then switch to the left as you lift your left knee up towards your right shoulder. Tense your abs and obliques to lift the knee up as high as you can. Push jack. Stand with feet together, elbows bent, palms facing up. Quickly jump feet apart and pump your arms up toward the ceiling like you're raising the roof. Reverse the movement and repeat as fast as you can. Sumo side bend. Stand with your feet in a wide stance, your toes pointing out to the sides and your hands behind your head. Bend your knees, press your hips back and bring your right elbow towards your right knee. Repeat on the left side and keep alternating sides. Twister, stand with your knees slightly soft, keep your pelvis stable as you rotate your rib cage right and left. Be sure to keep your abs pulled towards your spine as you twist from side to side. Can I be your superhero? 
Standing side crunches. Stand with your feet hip width apart and both hands behind your head. Bend at the waist and touch your right elbow to your right knee and crunch your abs as you do so. Stand back up and then crunch to your left side. Rotate back and forth for 40 seconds. Plank Jack. Start in a high plank with your palms flat on the floor, hands shoulder width apart, shoulders stacked directly above your wrist. Legs extended behind you and your core and glutes engaged. Jump your feet out and in. Try not to let your butt and hips bounce up and down as you jump your feet in and out. Pike up. Start in a high plank position with your hands directly under your shoulders. Engage your core and lift your hips high. At this point, your body should look like an upside down V. If your hamstrings are too tight to fully extend your legs, keep a slight bend in the knees. Thigh taps. Come back into a high plank by supporting your upper body with your palms on the ground and your feet resting on your toes. Keep one hand on the supporting position as the other hand taps the thigh. Return the hand to plank position and switch to the other side. Alternating leg raises. Continue in your plank position with your hands shoulder width apart, your shoulders, hips and ankles in a line. Keep your abs engaged and raise your right leg off the floor until it's about hip height. Keep right foot flexed, pause and lower your right leg back to the ground. Repeat with your left leg. Windshield wipers. Lie face up with arms straight out to the sides and legs extended. Face both your legs towards the ceiling until they're perpendicular to the floor. Without lifting head or shoulders off the floor, lower both the legs to the right as close to the floor as you can without losing any of your form. Reverse the movement to lower both the legs to the left. Continue to alternate like you guessed it. Windshield wipers.
Me in crunch, lie face up with fingertips behind your ears and legs extended. Lift your legs until feet are about 6 inches off the floor. Engage your core and lift your shoulder blades off the floor. Come up like you're doing a regular crunch while also pulling knees in towards chest. Careful not to pull on your neck. Use your abs to lift. Reverse the movement to return to starting position. Knee taps. Extend your legs up facing the ceiling. Your lower back remains flat and grounded the entire time. Lift your upper body to touch the knees. The right arm touches the left knee and the left arm touches the right knee without lowering your upper body the entire time and alternating the sides. Hollow body hold. Let's finish strong with an isometric hold, you guys. Lie face up with your arms by your sides and legs extended. Engage your abs and lift your shoulder blades and legs off the floor. Keep your lower back pressed into the floor throughout the exercise. The closer your legs are to the floor, the more challenging this is. Let's hold this for 40 seconds. Thank you so much for working out with me today guys. I hope you guys will enjoy this workout. I know I was definitely feeling it on that hold at the end. You gotta finish strong. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and also the bell icon so you get all my notifications and never miss a single workout from me. Until next week, bye-bye.